Hey guys, we're back with Nancy Drew. Oh shit. This hotel's pretty cool. I like this area. Alright, but we need to meet up with our friends. And then... I think I need to finish, actually. I didn't finish grading those papers. I'll have to wait until later. Oh shit, what time is it? Oh my god. Alright, I... I got all of these, pretty sure. Oh, maybe you don't really do anything after you finish it. Okay, never mind. This creepy ass music, though. I'm like trying to grade the damn papers. It's freaking me out. It has like, those sounds like, there's like alien sounds too? Why? Oh. I haven't gone into my suitcase yet. Nice. Oh, you can't eat the chocolate bars? Usually you can. Okay. Hackmeister? Whoa. Damn it, that's pretty edgy, Nancy. Oh, maybe we can leave now. I mean, it's kind of like 10 o'clock at night, though. Fuck it, we'll go out. We'll party. I need to translate that. Dude, I could translate it. Not with this. <laughs> okay, no. What are we doing? Okay, there we go. Let's go to the train. Ooh. Okay. I have no idea where I'm going, but let's just go somewhere. Put that away. Wait, no. I need a dictionary oh to translate God, that. For fuck's sake. Alright, that's how we do it. Alright, here we are. Well, let's see what's to see out here. Okay, how do I get out? Oh, maybe I can't leave here yet. Alright, hopefully... Is this where I get off? I don't know, I'm going all over the fucking world. Well... All right, Kyoto. Fuck, where's Kyoto? Or is this just... Okay, we need to get all the way... We need to get all the fucking way over there? They're really gonna make me do that? Ugh. Ugh. Why? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my god, that took so long. Please tell me this is where I get off. Is this not even a thing? Was this not even a fucking thing? Did I just do that for no reason? Because I thought that's where I had to go. And there's no way. <gasps> I just traveled around everywhere. Everywhere. But, I, but it said. <laughs> Fuck you. I nightlife of downtown Kyoto. Oh man. Alright, I guess it's just all Kyoto. I just <sighs> What am I doing with my life? Oh yeah, looked it up. I think tomorrow I have to on the game tomorrow I have to go to the expo. Alright, well <laughs> Is there a way to like jump in front of the train so I can just die and start over at the hotel? That's not a thing, is it? I just have to find my way back. It would be easier for me to just completely re I'm just reloading. I do not want to say it. No, I don't. Please. Oh. Thank God. Alright, now I just need to go back to my room and get that shit. But that's so much easier than going back on that train system. I'll do a puzzle. <laughs> Wait, how do I do the puzzle? I wanna do it. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Ten years later. Hey, it's it. a heart. Yay, we got the heart. Let's go tell Rentoro. At least I did something. 
Oh god, don't let me see that robotic cat. Wait, what is what does this stuff say? Oh, I think that's just our names. Okay. Let me put my dictionary away. No! Oh my god, I hate. <laughs> Hi! I did it! Wait, hold on, I have other questions too, though. Do you believe that the Ryokan is haunted? I don't believe that anything is haunted. Ghosts uh, are just what happens when guilty people let their imaginations run wild. What do you mean? Think about it. Why do ghosts always want revenge? They're what people invent when they feel guilty. If that wasn't the case, then ghosts would want all sorts of things. But no, they always want revenge. I finished the nanograms puzzle. Awesome! Nice job! What do you think? Nah. Eh. I've got something better. You know it, you love it. The original Sudoku! No. Oh, I've played that before. Great, great! I've got some good ones for you here. I'm here fine, really, I'm fine. Bring it back if you want more. <laughs> no, I'm good. Thank you, though. <laughs> I'm back for more nanograms. Is that the portrait from the lobby? Yeah, I'm reframing it. Although it's way harder to do than I thought it would be. It's got a really strange backing. Would you like some help? Have at it. This thing is officially making me nuts. The tools you'll need are near the frame. Hmm, okay, I can do this. It looks like I need to find a way to make sure none of the wires are crossing. Fuck, all right. Well, ten years later, let me think about this. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is this, you guys? What the fuck is this? <laughs> this is awful. I will get this. Hey. Do you know what's scaring the guests away? City superstitions. I don't get it. We have ghost hunters who come here to find ghosts, and if they think they found something, they get all panicked and run away. I hate this puzzle. I hate I'll this puzzle so much. Catch you around. I don't Hi. even think this is like the difficult puzzle of the game. I should go. All right, I slept. Oh shit! What the fuck is that? It's a fucking ghost. Or someone fucking with us. What was that? Oh no! The screen tore. I better tell Mawako about this tomorrow. Ah, oh, shit. It must have just been my imagination. I should try to get some more No, sleep. it was a ghost. Wait, why are we outside? Okay. All right, yeah, we went to school, blah, blah, blah. We taught the kids. Okay. Damn. Maybe they're just acting like it's a ghost so they can like charge us for damages in the room. You never know. You never know. Right, let's go. Hello. Oh, hi, Nancy. What was the name of the place you're staying at again? The Rio Con Hie. Told you. Guess you're right. What are you two talking about? We met this girl at a bento booth at the expo. And she grew up at the Ryokan you're staying at. Pretty crazy coincidence. Is her name Yumi? That's the one. You've got to get down here and meet her. She's so much fun. She told us all about everyone at the Ryokan, and it sounds like you've got your hands full. I should come to meet her. I have a few questions. Uh-oh. Uh-oh what? I know that tone of voice. What tone of voice? Yep, that's the one. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're working a case, aren't you? Maybe. I don't know exactly what is going on at the Ryokan, but it's really strange. Busted. Okay, you got me. I may have found a mystery. 
Shocking. So, what can we do for you? Yeah, what's going on? Well... I saw something really strange in my room. What? A shadowy figure showed up in my room, but when I looked out on the balcony, no one was there. It was like whoever it was just disappeared. Creepy. Okay, that's it. We're leaving Japan. I'm sure there is a logical no, explanation. No, it was a ghost. Me too. I'm just not sure what it is yet. The two of you, I swear, if we were being chased by a dinosaur, you two would be too busy debating about the fossil record to run away. Where is your sense of panic? <laughs> it was pretty scary, I admit. But I don't believe that someone could just disappear. Right. Well, you said a shadow figure, right? Maybe it was some sort of trick of the light. That's what I was thinking. I'll keep an eye out for something like that. Spooky. Anything, Anything else? else that isn't the freaking puzzle. How's the expo going, George? It's crazy. I've never seen so many clever people in one space. I'm definitely dealing with a little bit of that small fish, large pond anxiety. I'm still trying to get tickets for you, but it's not looking good. That's okay. Thanks for trying. Okay, I know how. Okay, let's go to the um, expo. I should go. I'll talk to you later. Bye. All right, it's in Matsu, so we need to get to the train station. Ten years later, hopefully we'll make it there. Get my dictionary out. All right, here we are. Hopefully this works. Yes. Okay, we're at the expo. Do I have tickets? Ew, the robot cats are here. Yeah. Hi, is your name Yumi? Absolutely not. Who's asking? It might be. Are you going to order? What's your agenda here, stranger? <laughs> I'm Nancy Drew. Nope, never heard the of you, Nancy thank Drew you for agenda. saying your name out loud. Oh wait, Nancy Drew? As in friends with Bess and George and staying at the Ryokan, Nancy Drew? Or are there two of you? Which one is it? That's me, the friends with Bess and George. Excellent. Yes, perfect. Get over here, come on. You're learning to make bento the Yumi way. Come on, trust me, it's a life skill. Once you know how to make a good bento box, you pretty much got the whole world all figured out. Um, did I just get roped into making bento? Like, girl, you're on the clock. I don't work here. You go ahead and make it yourself. I just had a question or two. But I don't know how to make bento. You'll figure it out. Or maybe you won't. Well, I guess we'll see. Here are the Am I being paid for this? You may notice that they run the gamut from pretty cute to insanely adorable. This is not an accident. Okay, very easy. The customers will give you a list of what they want and how they want it organized, and you pack it together. He won't believe how easy it is. Okay, this I gotta girl go. just going. To Where are you job going? For her. The store. Good luck. What the fuck? You'll do fine. Hell no! I don't need to know I'll about the ghosts. Soon. Oh my god! Wait. I guess I'd better get to we work. We just got scammed. All right, is this? Fuck! What am I doing? Hey, I did oh, it! Oh, thank God. It was pretty cute. Thanks for helping out, Nancy. Your grandmother seems a little hesitant to talk to me. That's the shocker of the decade. She's hesitant to talk to herself. Could you tell me a little bit about the Ryokan? I'm not into that sort of thing. Couldn't you find a pamphlet? I was hoping for an insider's Didn't you say opinion? she would talk to us oh, about it? I get it. <laughs> you want the dirt on the situation, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> Interesting. You're working some kind of angle here, aren't you? Not that it matters, still way too busy to talk. I know you're busy, but I helped you out with bento, and all I want is a little information. Guilt tripper. Okay. Surrounded by breathtaking views you'll not soon forget, the Ryoka Hie opens the door to a simpler time. Perfect for the business traveler hoping to experience traditional mm. Japan, or the family in search Girl, of that perfect vacation. I did the Ryoka fucking Hie, bento. Discover Japan, discover you. That's persuasive, but not exactly what I wanted to know. Isn't it? That's mine from years back. I was thinking of going into advertising, but then I thought, nah. I was hoping you could tell me a little about some of the strange things that have been happening. Aha. If you really want to know. Oh no, I'm running out of bento boxes. Can you please go grab my backpack <laughs> from my apartment? This is the sort of thing that can move us from buddies to straight up besties. 
Uh, uh, where's your fucking apartment? Sure. Great. It's just over by the Kurume station. I could tell right away that we were going to be friends. Here's my key. I'm stealing shit from her apartment. She's pissed oh, me off. Oh, and P.S. My number is 075-021-5855. I'm about to call and talk shit. I met your sister, Miwako. You two seem pretty close. That doesn't sound like the impression you'd get by having a chat with Miwako. What are you trying to ask? Miwako seemed a little upset about the Ryokan. Do you know anything about that? That's more her area of expertise. I've never been the go-to girl for the Ryoka. That place is the definition of repetitive. Guests come in, guests come out. It's brain-breakingly tedious. I don't know how Miwako puts up with it. Does Miwako like working at the Ryokan? Well, yeah. Why else would she be there day in and day out? What that Gura needs is to spend some time out here. A few weeks with me and my friends would be enough to shake her up and get her to have some fun for once. What do you think of Rantaro? Other than that he should get a job at the Nerd Statue Factory as their primary Damn. model. Damn! He's a good time. What do you think of Rentaro? There's something Talk shit. a little weird about him. Yeah, that weird thing about him ah! is his personality. <laughs> that kid is his own special kind of neurotic. Damn. <laughs> Always has been. But he's my fake little brother, so I'm used to it. Until someone brings it up, I forget how he must seem when you first meet him. What do you mean by fake little brother? He first moved in next door when I was seven and Miwako was five. He followed us around day and night. One day, when he was being a real pain to Miwako, she just snapped and punched him hard. It was bad news. My mother saw. After that, we had to be nice to him no matter what, at least when she was in sight. Eventually, he grew on us, especially Miwako. I don't understand. If you're the one who's supposed to take over the Ryokan, why is Miwako the one working there? Ugh, Nancy-chan. Don't get all everyone else on me here. If I had known I was supposed to run that place when I grew up, I would have taken a pass on the whole firstborn thing. Trust me. If Miwako left the Ryokan, who would run it? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Why do you care so much about it anyway? I'm just sort of naturally curious. I'd back burner that curiosity as long as you're staying at the Ryokan if I were you. What do you mean? Try not to find out, okay, Nancy? You seem nice. <laughs> Nancy, do you have my boxes? Not yet. I'm falling apart here. I need this those boxes. This girl just uses me. All right, at least she gave us some more information, though. Can I find George and Bess here? Oh, God, not the fucking cats. Anything but that. No ticket, no entry. God damn it. I don't have a ticket. Uh, let's get our stupid bento boxes. Or throw ourselves in front of a train. Either way, I'd be happy. Whee! All right, we're here. Yes, we are here. All right, time to steal her shit. These must be what Yumi was talking about. All right, snoop all up in her apartment. Okay. What else you got over here? Ooh, ghosts. To the Shimutsu family, your hospitality during this difficult time has been immeas immeasurable. Thank you for allowing me into your home and your lives. If you ever find yourselves in the state of Georgia, you've got a place to stay. Sincerely, Savannah H. Woodham. Okay, so the author was at their hotel. Savannah Woodham. That's the author of this book. I should hang on to this. Having her phone number might come in handy. Ooh. All right, go to chapter six. It looks like someone tore out one of the chapters. Oh, of course. The fucking chapter with the hotel. All right. We're calling her bitch ass. I'm calling multiple people right now. No, not you. Not you. Yes, you. Savannah Woodham's office. Logan speaking. Can I speak to Savannah Woodham, please? Are you one of our interviews? Interviews? I'm Savannah Woodham's assistant. Is she interviewing you about the expo? No, I actually want to speak to Savannah about a book she wrote. Oh, great! I'm so glad you called. Really? Why's that? It's been like three days since I've gotten to hang up on anyone. I wonder if I'm still good at it. Damn! Hung up on! Hello! Knock in! Bye-bye! Oh, 
fun going through your shit, Yumi. I hope you're happy. Steal our electronics. Make your own shadow puppets? Oh, shit, you guys. Give it a try right now. Go ahead. Give it a try. <laughs> All right. Ooh, she got anything we can put in here? No. All right. Oh, wait, that was just the book. Ooh, let's creep on her online profiles. Oh, fuck. 